Bill Green was a great minister about 50 or 75 years ago to the western country, and he preached everywhere. And one night he had a dream. And in this dream, he thought he died. And he went through space and went up to the heavenly gate. And he knocked at the door. And the caretaker came to the door. And he said, Who art thou? He said, I'm Daniel Green the Evangelist. He said, I preach the gospel all to the United States. I've seen hundreds of men and women come to the Lord Jesus. So let me see, Mr. Green. He said, there's nothing on the book here by the name of Daniel Green. Oh, he said, surely my name's there. No, there's nothing here. Oh, he said, what a disappointment. He said, what shall I do? He said, I can only point you to one thing. That's the white throne judgment. Well, he said, I have no choice. I'll have to take it. Brother, you never want to stand at that place. So he said he went through space for a long time. After a while, it began to slow up. It began to get light. Lighter, lighter, lighter. Until he came right into the center of a great light. He looked around. There was nobody around him. And he thought, oh, what a place. And he heard a voice say, who art thou? And he said, I'm Daniel Green. I'm the evangelist. I have preached and I've preached. And they failed to find my name on the record at the gate. And they referred me to your judgment throne. All right, Daniel Green, said the voice in the man's dream. He said, I have a law here. And it says that the wages of sin is death. And if you break the least of my commandments, there's nothing left for you but doom. He said, Daniel Green, Did you ever tell a lie? He said, I thought I'd been truthful until I was in the presence of that light. And you'll think the same because you're mortal. And you think, well, I'm a pretty good fellow. But if you ever stand in the presence of that light, you'll find out you're a sinner. He said, I thought I'd been truthful, but I found out there that there'd been many things that I wasn't just exactly honest about. He said, yes, Lord, I have lied. He said, Daniel Green, did you ever steal? He said, Oh, I thought I'd never stole anything. But said, in the presence of that light, there's a lot of little shady things that I've done that stood way big. And I know I couldn't tell nothing but truth then. Said, yes, Lord, I, I have stole. And said he was waiting. To hear that great roar from out in that light somewhere saying, Depart out of my present, you wicked person. And said, Then he felt a hand on his shoulder. Said, When he turned to look, is the sweetest face that he had ever saw. There was no mother's face to take its place. And said it looked at him and slipped his arm around his shoulders. And it was Jesus. And he said, Father, 
that's true, Daniel Green on earth done a lot of things that were bad. But Father, while he was on earth in the midst of criticism, in the midst of trouble, he stood for me. And now while he's here helpless, I'll stand for him. Put all his sins to my charge. God be merciful. Let that be William Branham at that day. I don't want all my trouble. I want to stand for him right now. I want to do everything, no matter how much I'm called holy roader or, or a witch doctor or whatever it might be or mental telepathy or I don't care what they do. I know God's truth. I know His Spirit and His truth bears record. And I stand for Jesus Christ. Looking for Him at that day to stand for me. Dear God, one of these nights I'm going to have my last message. I'm going to close this old Bible the last time. And the church is going to make its last prayer. And all of a sudden there will be a scream from heaven. A daddy will wake up some morning and look for wife and she'll be gone. He'll run to the cradle for baby and baby's gone. He'll call the pastor. The pastor's gone. Oh, Lord. What will their little records and little parties mount to then? What will all their impersonation and what will all their going to church mean then? Not a bit. Won't count nothing. Oh, eternal God, shake man tonight and women before judgment shakes them. May they come to mercy and make a stand for thy Son, Jesus. Grant it, Lord. Have mercy, Lord, one more time. Grant, Lord, that your Spirit will now take over and do the rest of the warning. Through Jesus Christ.